Thank you very much for the affection that has been displayed today now. Today uh, we have achieved what we set out to achieve in 2019. It was delayed by about four years, but we have done it. When uh, Chandrayaan-3 was launched, after the separation of the spacecraft from launch vehicle, I said, I will speak the rest of the things after the soft landing. So he will, here I will take a couple of minutes to tell the tremendous amount of effort that has been put in by the entire project team. When I say project team, it is not just only uh, the project director and uh, associate project director. Of course, they are the face of the project. They have been living, sleeping, eating, breathing Chandrayaan for the last four years. They have been supported by such a large number of people, particularly in the uh, navigation, guidance and control area, propulsion system. This area, the amount of effort that has been put by people, the number of simulations that have been done, the number of reviews they have gone through, the amount of criticism they faced and uh, overcome that. It is, uh, I, as a person who has been watching this uh, for the last uh, four years along with them, my heart feels, my heart goes out for them. The amount of effort is tremendous. That is what ISRO is all about. That is what our organization has taught us to do. Now today this success has put us even more higher responsibility as the Honorable Prime Minister was telling because we have set the bar now so high. Nothing, nothing less than nothing less spectacular than this is going to be inspiring for any, any of us in the future. So as the Honorable Prime Minister mentioned, we will, we will be now looking at putting the man in uh, space, putting a spacecraft around uh, Venus and landing a craft in uh, Mars. Work on all these activities are going on for few years and uh, this success today will inspire us and will spur us to take those efforts even more strongly so that uh, we will make our country proud again and again and again. Thank you very much for every one of you who have directly or indirectly participated in this mission, encouraged us, intentionally or unintentionally helped us in, in all, 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 for every one of, every one of you. A big thank you because even, even a, a casual remark, an unintended point can, can help a person who is uh, striving to reach a goal, it, the person who is making that remark may not have meant it that way, but sometimes it can ignite. A, a, that's why I, I said that even unintended help is, uh, is very, very, very uh, welcome and we are very, very thankful for that. Thank you, Team ISRO, for uh, supporting all of us. The amount of affection I, we received when this mission came into this final stage, the number of people who gave us confidence that nothing can go wrong and uh, this is going to be successful. The amount, the, in fact, I was not that much confident because uh, we have seen a couple of times uh, issues because I, I know very well as a, as a person who has been doing in this, uh, in this domain for 36 years, I know there are thousands of things, any of that could uh, can anytime go wrong and derail but so many of the people because that I only see as the reflection of the effort we have put that people are so, so, so happy to see this effort and they want us to succeed. It is not that uh, we are, they know that we are going to succeed, the people want us to succeed. So thank you very much for uh, everyone for your love and affection. We will continue to do our best and make our flag fly, ISRO's as well as India's flag fly high. Thank you very much.